Oh, I see. So, um, yeah, that's that's what I know. Yeah, yeah, that's right. They're going down there. But I've got my hui right on that day. I've got my hui right on that day, the same day. That's for the. I'm doing. I'm doing some some work on uh, uh, Hori Takuri up up in uh, uh, Hokianga. Oh, okay. On 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 Hori Takuri, uh, the British title. I'm going right back into that. Oh, okay. Where's, uh, where's Bundy? Bundy? Well, they, they up there. I just spoke to him yesterday. And I spoke to him and Manahi yesterday. So um, uh, they seem to be um, still behind me. Although they've got, got, got some other things on. There's, there's quite a bit on. And... and uh, uh, Charlie Hohepa's taken 30 people up to the uh, World Court in Brussels, so that's going on. I, I didn't know about that lot, but that's what they told me yesterday. Bundy uh, told me yesterday. Well, uh, somewhere, somewhere, what did they just say? That uh, they're all getting ready to, uh, to go up to the King's Bench on the 6th. 6th of February, yeah, well. That I don't know either, what's happening with them, because they've pulled right out and gone with Morris Baker with the British titles he's holding. Uh-huh. Morris Baker. He's up in, he's up in Tahiki and up in Hokianga. He's, uh, he's, he's a guy that's been sitting low, so I'm working with him on his land blocks now. Uh, uh, I'll probably start up there before anywhere else, because... Um, uh, he's been very, very clever to get ten blocks, big blocks back from the Maryland court. Yeah, well, well, well I had to credit the to what they do. Why? Oh, well, they, they, uh, there's one lot I had to say, they can say that they're the Matatu Waka Corporation. Oh, no. Yes, it, it, it was the Umuri Waka Waka, you know, to buy me money. Yeah, yeah. Which 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 marae which marae is this? not the one we went to? Yes. That one. Yes. Shit, that's not right. I know that's not they're not right to do what they're doing. That they're going off on another on another tangent. Yeah, yeah. So what's the name of that marae again? Um, uh, Omuri Waka. Omuri, Omuri. Yeah, Omuri Waka. Oh, I thought it was Waimana. Um, yeah, well, no, well, it's not Waimana, but it's uh, the marae itself. It's Omuri Waka, that's the Chinese marae. Oh, Tepari, yeah, the old fella. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, the kids are taking it over and they're taking it over and they, they're all saying that uh, they are the Mata to Waka. But you're the oldest one on that. Any of those marais, they shouldn't do that. That's right. They shouldn't do that. They're, they're, they're not right. As far as I'm concerned, they're out of order. Yeah, that's right. That's what I told them. Mm. So but, they're, 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 I don't know what they're, what they're doing. They're not doing anything about it. I'm not coming with you brother, until you get it all right. Get it right. That's what's happening up at, at Waitangi Marae. The, those young fellows have taken over up there from uh, Nati Hine have taken over the Titi Marae and they kicked me off. So I, I won't go back again. I'm going to Tahiki Marae now where the British are. I'm not going back to Titi Marae anymore because, and I'm telling them on YouTube and Facebook that the mana's up in Tahiki with the British title. Not, at, yeah. Tahiki is, is, Tahiki is just west of uh, uh, Kaikohi. No, no, Kaikohi is just west of Kaikohi. Oh, well, yeah. Well, the, 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 I'm gone with the Pohara Pa. You know where Pohara Marae is? No. That's Mangatotari Mountain at, uh, at uh, Karapiro. That, that's where I'm, my father-in-law comes from there. Well, that's, that's the main Marae of that chief uh, Manukau. 
But the Manukau of history, eh? This is what's what's confusing me, uh, I just want to say, me and me anyway. Yep. It's uh, either uh, you're going this way, another one going that way, another one going down the middle. Uh, Man, I'm confused. Yeah, no, what's happened is, what's happened is... Yeah, no, what's happened is I've gone the old way, that right back to 1823, when the British came into Hokianga, they stuck their British title there, it's still there, and the one at Rangitukia, the baker, the, ba the baker that I'm, I'm with in Hokianga, that's the baker that did that Rangitukia uh, school, that's where the magistrate was. He was the magistrate, William Baker. I've got all that history, and that baker is the same one as... Morris Baker up, up in Taheke, up at uh, 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 Rawene, Rawene, that place up there where the mission house is in, in uh, uh, Mangungu, Mangungu, Ma, um, um, what's his name, uh, Manahi, Manahi is, is, is stuck right behind me on that, he, that's where he lives, he lives there right there on that uh, Taheke Road, Horeke, where, where the ships were built in the old days, the British ships. So that's where I'm gone, back into that history, and on our land block at Rangitukia, 1823. Hmm. Well, I'll, I'll just say to, uh, to uh, um, uh, uh, what's his name, Willie Baker? Yeah. Yeah, so they're arguing, not me. So I've got both of them. I'm not going to bother with you guys again until, until something positive comes up. And, well, I'm going to write my car anyway. I'm a right man, so I'm going down there anyway. And I said to them, well, I'll meet you when I'm down there if you want to arrive there because I'm going myself. Yeah. And I have to go. I have to go because I'm a right man, I'm a minister. Yeah. So, so that's what's happened. With the Ratna Church, when Nuki Ulrich died, uh, uh, Hayward, Hay Hayward uh, Brown and the other Apotoros said that they're not going to let the government go back into Ratna anymore. So that's going to be something of a change on uh, on the day on the, uh, the 25th, where where the oh, government. Well, I, well, I'd like to see that. Well, that's now I'm going to go. Yeah. So no, so. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah, well, he, 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 he's, he's in the government. Uh, uh, yeah, so... He's running with the, with the Labour Party. Yeah. So that's going to be interesting who turns up from the government or yeah. what, what party's going to turn up. I know Labour, Jacinda Ardern, is going to Titi Marai when Bill English said they're not going there. So that's going to be quite interesting to see what the Labour Party's going to do. And uh, if they are still going to go, regardless of what what uh, what Hayward said, Hayward's talking from Titi Marai. We've got to pull them up. Hey? We've got to pull them up. Well, that's right. Somebody's got to do something because the the well, that's why that that's why they have to go to Ratna to get permission to use the Native Land Act. And and, and 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 without yeah that that's why yeah carry on okay okay all right then okay all right okay thanks for you hey yep hey What's that? What'd you say? Oh, that's Jim Wickorton. That's the Wickorton. Jim Wickorton. He's from uh, uh, down in uh, Whakatoa here. <coughs>
the chief down there, the old fella. He's older than me. Maybe about 75, I suppose. Same age as Kingy. And uh, so his Matatua has been taken over by the young people up in that Marae. I, I always didn't know what that Marae's name was. Now it's Omori Waka, Omori Waka Marae. Uh, that's where Tipari, the old guy Tipari, I knew Tipari. Marae. My mana. That's where we had the hui. We opened that up as the native court. And now they've run off. They've run off with the incorporations. I'll, I'll tell you something. I'll tell you something. The incorporations belong to the Maori government, which is the government of Wellington. I'm telling you flat out. The government of Wellington is the Maori government. Whether you like it or not, they are the ones that created Maori. And the word Maori and iwi crown. They own the copyrights and the patent rights to use that name. Anything with Maori. That's why I put Maui in front of them. Because Maui is a memorial of the whole Pacific discovery title. I've got enough stuff on my page on one of the 97 out of 107 pages on Facebook uh, sites. 97 sites. That's telling you everything about who we are as Maui, not Maori. There's no such thing as Maori. It's made up. So, unfortunately for the incorporations, you're going to get a bill. You're going to get this bill here of 970 million trillion trillion pound note because I'm acting, sorry to king, with this flag that they're flying. You're flying the flag in the wrong jurisdiction. You people down there, you think you know, don't overstep the old people because you've got the cart before the horse. But Jim is one to gamble with other jurisdictions. You see, they all say, I'm confusing everybody. No, it's too clever for anybody, what I do. It's only for sharp shooters. Up here. Not people who don't know what a piece of paper is. With a deed title. Yeah? Deed title. Okay. Morris Bacon. Deed title. Unless you can get those off the land, you're pretty well stuck with what you've got with the Queen. This is a king. This is a king. This is a king. And everything I talk is king. Not Queen. The incorporations are under the Government of Wellington sharing the Tiruwhenua Act 1993, and that's where the problem is. This is not the Tiruwhenua Act. This is not the Tiruwhenua Act. This flag is not the Tiruwhenua Act. This is straight British Paramount Chief. There are no Paramount Chiefs around. There is only one, and that's Morris Baker, that's acting with me on his D titles. Back to 1823, same as the Manukau titles, D titles, right here. D titles that's got rejected from Lynn's, New Zealand and your incorporations, businesses, that are sharing this queen side against the king that got you on these lands in the first place with these deed titles. Unless you've got a British deed title like this, you're pretty well stuck in debt. You'll never get out of it. You're in this system. Here. The four tribes and the confederation of chiefs that are using this flag for the wrong reasons. It won't work in the confederation of chiefs. It won't work. I'm telling you. I've been through it all. Can't tell me what to do. Can't tell me how it works because I've been there long enough to know everything of how it works. So that was Jim for you. After a long period of time, he goes and rings me up on my old phone. That's on this Chinese phone here. The old number 0272813963. That's the original number that was with the shares 
on the Moai Tidal Turbines. Okay, so I put it back on on my new phone, ready to go with the shares. And I've got to ring Cecile Hoods afterwards and see what's going on with her and the website that's supposed to be up and running as soon as I get going. <coughs> um, so I'm relying on her to manage the business here. And she's had long enough before Christmas, in fact in about November, October, no, October, when I, up at the 28th of October, uh, uh, Confederation Day uh, for the Chiefs. Uh, Declaration of Independence Day. That's where I met her. So from that day, the 28th of October, 2017, right till now, she's had plenty of time to get my website sorted. And I'm just going to check up on it and see how she's getting on. Jackie and Andy in Scotland is waiting. They've been waiting for a long time. Patience um, is a virtue. So I just want to uh, reiterate on what I'm saying about um, Right in the church, and the 25th of um, January, birthday, 2018, down at Right in the Park, in uh, um, uh, down Wanganui, on the way to Shannon, that way. Um, uh, that that's that's uh, where the government usually goes to get permission to use the 1862 Native Land Act. That's Rafa Rafa Manukau, right? That's me as his executor and surrogate chief paramount in his absence. Okay, so that's that chief back to Mangatotari Mountain in Kaipara, uh in um, um, Karapiro and Alapuni, between Karapiro and Alapuni and Kiki, Kiki in Cambridge area of Waikato. The Waikato name, Tira Waikato, Fare Hirehire Manukau. I'm the surrogate for him, 1823. And Horitikuri, 1823. Up in Taheke, Marae Taheke village. And uh, Lobo uh, Morris Baker. I'll give him a ring shortly, see how he's getting on. In fact, I might ring him now. Uh, while I'm talking to you, I'll finish off uh, by saying where I'm at at the moment with uh, Manahi yesterday on the phone to me. Just to catch up, he'll be coming to the uh, court hearing in uh, um, Epsom on the 26th on this video. The hearing for all the people accused, including John Key and James Pierce Brown, Simon Brent Roundtree, the owners of or the occupiers of 77 Cook Street, I'm putting you on notice that you've got to turn up. If you don't turn up to this hearing, you didn't turn up to the last one, if you don't turn up to this one, I take the lead with these warrants. Here. There's enough in it that will take the whole country with this. If I tell the British Empire, strikes again to seize it, the same as they did to Honeheke, they will do it again and seize the whole country back into the British Empire under the Brexit government, minus the Queen and her royal family and the Rothschilds out of it. They're going to get bankrupted with this down note. And in Ernest Augusta, 970 million trillion trillion pounds. It's green. Cover. I'm going to make another one like this. Here, and get it, the cover on it like that. Glass cover behind. Apostolize this. I'll be apostolizing this one with Jamie and myself as applicable to me. And um, her, she wants to stay with her own Patrick family here, but I'm going with my own Patrick family in Dub uh, Belfast. Northern Ireland, uh, with my Patrick family there, my Rogan family, and my Cosmo family there. That's a back cover for the postally, and I'll zap holes in it, put this on it. There, yeah, dunk. I should have been doing this long ago, but now the other 
things come up, my brain turns on to something else, turbines, something else, and away it goes. And so that's what I'll be doing today. That's what I said yesterday, the day before, the day before. Ten days of podcast, fifteen days of podcast. I haven't even done it yet. So I'll be getting on to that shortly to get all these documents ready to notarize with an approved notary public to the internal affairs and the foreign affairs to Britain. Now, I'll put it online first before it gets there so that it makes sure it's notified that it's going to get there and not going to get sabotaged on the way. Okay, so that's, that's really what I want to say there uh, to keep you enlightened of everything that's happening. I'll put a note there for Dow Payne and the Americans um, um, I've sent them an email to tell them the jurisdictions of America is America only. Any documents in America is America only. It cannot jump into the King's realms or the British Empire. It can't be done in the British Empire unless you've got a contract. Like these. These. Contract with the names on them. Okay? So, Elk, um, although you've got uh, a good ideas, you know what you have to do there uh, if you wanted a seal for an international seal. It still had to come from the government in your area. The same way some are going through the government here. Even though they're in power, not me. I have to go through their system in, uh, in order to get it apostolized through a system to Britain, then international from Britain. I still have to go singly into each country unless I make a deal with Britain. When I'm holding on to these pound notes, I'll make any sort of deal. Okay? But that's eight point star. And this note bankrupts anybody that's a third party. Queenside, the Rothschilds, United Nations, anybody. China is now involved in the fraud business with this flag. Anybody that's found to be trading with this flag, you're in trouble with the contract partner, ship of Admiralty, Magistrate, Court, Native. Okay? The native landowners of all native lands in the world is from this flag, the King's flag of jurisdiction of magistrate, magistrate back. Um, so that's what I want to say about that. The Jim Wikotu is in Matatu Waka. It struck a, a, a problem. They're all going to strike problems because they're in the wrong jurisdiction. They can stay there because it, that's what's in their brain. They haven't changed with the times. They have not moved on into the intelligence side of documents that have moved ahead of them while they're still playing around with old documents that are redundant. Titular Fenwell, Native Land Act, all of those things are in its own jurisdiction. It cannot match this jurisdiction. Because this is the jurisdiction that got them on the land in the first place. To trade. They have permission to trade, but if they break these laws, all these laws, the king's laws in here, the hex in here, that I'm using on anybody, then we'll swipe you with this down there, of King Ernest Augustus, the incumbent King of Britain, UK, Hanover, and Altair New Zealand, Pacific Islands, and the Commonwealth countries, 250 countries with the flag, and this eight point star municipalities to collect the rent off you. We're going to collect the rent off you and the fines for corrupting the king's flag. All you people that are flying this flag, tell me why are you flying it? What for? What for? It's either the 1840 Treaty of Waitangi, or the 1835 Declaration of Independence, or the 1834 flag itself, that's the founding flag of this country, the real one, 
or it's the 1823 contract with Te Rawaikato, Wharehere and Manukau, Bewhere for Manukau, and Horitakuri, those three chiefs and the three kings, King William III, King William IV and King George IV made all this British Empire into what it is with the pound note and the pound and pound note Bank of England and the commerce of birth certificates, birth deaths and marriages, certificates uh, on the stock exchange and also the trade with this flag around the world. Somebody's using it. I'm going to find out who it is. And pull them up with this ship of our Okay, so that's that. I'll just give um, our ring. Talk to them again. Oh, I'd like to talk to Morris. Boys, he's still at work. Right. I'll wait till his mobile phone is uh, phone. Hello. Hello, Mr. Morris. Hello, I just had a call from Manahi yesterday. Right. Yeah, he's telling me a few more things. He, he's, he's not going to shift away from us. <laughs> he's, not, <laughs> he's not going down to Ratna. He said, oh, his wife is over here in Auckland waiting for the hui this Friday. I said, no, it's next Friday. I said, you haven't been watching Facebook and, and, and what I've been writing. Uh, um, and so he said, oh, oh, that's all right. She'll just stay here and wait till next week. So, so that's him counted out of the Ratna, going down to Ratna. And then Bundy rang me up. Did I tell you? He rang me up. Yeah, so that's cleared up with him. They're sitting tight. And they're not going to say much uh, than, than to see where we're going. And, uh, well, that's what it appears to look like. Because Bundy, Bundy just told me that um, um, he's more or less given up on Charlie and going to uh, the, the World Court. He's not going down that track. And so it's only left him to put the flag up. He, that's that's what he wants to do. He's going to put the flag up on, on the treaty grounds. I'm not worried about that. I'm not worried about the, the Waitangi Marae at, at all. I'm I'm only I'm only concerned about the flag, the way we're flying. Not 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 mixed up over there. We we we're, we're flying. That's what I said to him. We're flying it separate. And now money has gone and jumped on board with us. Um, but I'm well, still. After that, eh? Well, after that. Yeah, and he's crossed up. The Ratna, even though he's a Ratna, he's crossed it out and he's coming this way. I said, I um, want to see which way you're going. You're going down the Ratna or you're coming to the Hui? And he says, no, he's coming to the Hui. See, see what I mean? He's gone against his own church. What's that? Did he ask what? I said, I'm stuck to you. We've got, we've got, we've got things to do. And we're not worrying about anybody else. And what did he say? And he said, oh, no, he'll come in support at the hui. He'll, he'll come in support. And yeah, I, right. I, still, I still keep a race of, yeah, of yeah. him and his tribe down the east coast. The uh, Ru Waipu is in Ngāti Pro. Oh, that, that's the part. I'll keep that right up out of the way. It's still just me and you and, 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 and Mary Ann to go to Britain. Uh, I, I won't be taking. I won't be taking anything anybody else because of the history that he's gone on. It, nobody's just going to jump in like that. I'm, I'm not letting anybody because they haven't got. I, I only talk to people with D, D titles. That's that's what this. That's what this is. The flag, the D titles, the king, and us. Yeah, that's all. Yeah. Yeah. Now and then. Jimmy, Jim, Jim. Oh, what's going to happen? Um, I, I had a good time with her. With 
Oh yeah, that was Adrian. Hello, hello. Something yeah. happened. Something happened to your phone. I didn't hear what you said. It went black. Oh, I was having a call with Adrian. Yeah. And with my sister's uh, daughter over there. Yeah. And I spoke with Mary Anna. Yeah. And I get yours. You can about five, six of us come down to that. We are the pretty. Oh, good. That's right. Because. So we were I yeah. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, man, my mother is quite clear. I said, I don't want, you know, you're wasting my time. Yep. I said, yeah, this is a big thing, this. Yep, it and is. And I said, I'm going to go. Oh, your phone. Yeah, that's right. Someone, someone's blessed. I didn't hear a word you said. Something's happened to the phone. Oh. It went, it went off. I didn't hear what you said the last, the last uh, um, minute. The two of the half of the was coming down. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Oh, yeah, that's fine because I'll... I'm going to call, I'm going to call, I'm going to call it support. Yeah, so that'll be good. Yeah, that'll make it good for us. No, that's on the record. It goes on the record. Yeah, that's right. That for your support, yeah. for your support there, because I think they realise that there's something, there's something real in it. Well, the all these people must be must be real. You see, a lot of them on the on the on the bloody thing, and what all of a sudden they jump around like like a king. Yeah. Oh, it's just, just somebody's buzzing the phone. Someone's buzzing the phone. Either your end or my end. That that someone came and go beep like that. Well, Oh, well, it must be around somewhere here or somewhere. Uh, but anyway, I, I, uh, I can hear now, so if it does happen again, I'll, I'll carry on talking. Uh, but uh, that'll be good for you because we're building you up in, in the business to go straight off. As soon as I go to see the lawyer and get him to seal the things, I'll put, give it, we're, we're going straight into business. And, and if, if, if need be, uh, I, I will come up there to make sure everything is going to go according to plan. I, I did a big cost up on, on all the water things yesterday. And so I've gone a bit further. It's better if I just set up a bot bottling company and, uh, and keep it under the flag, under the, under the Maui brand, for, for marketing it and getting it out there. But the water will be, the water will be your property. There's somebody buzzed it again. If you talk, it just went again, but I'll just keep on going. Uh, so that's what I've got on, uh, I've put together. Um, we'll be talking about that as well after the hui at, in, uh, uh, oh, at uh, Tūnga Wakamarae. Well, that's good that they sort of just done the, um, just done the rest of it more now, eh? Yeah, because and... Like you see, that, you know, you think that you're putting, people yeah. are starting to respond to it. They're really, really watching those videos. They're watching the videos, what I'm saying. And, and Jim Weekotu rang me up this morning, just a while ago. He's down in uh, Waimana, in La So, oh, uh, shut. Someone's buzzed the phone again. And, and, and that was why you didn't hear me for, for, for that period of time. So if you don't hear me, if you don't hear me talk, that's what it is. I, I can well, um, I'll give it to you to see Mary is just coming. Okay. And I'm going to have something to bite and I'm going to with you to work and I'll, I'll give you a ring sometime this evening. Mate. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, hey. okay, then, yeah, that's all right. Oh, that's good news, John. Yeah, that's good news, okay. Yeah. It's, oh, yeah. It's getting I'll up. give you a ring okay. well, um, later on during the day. Okay. Because I'm going to have some to eat and I'm going to have to help. Yeah, give her a hand. Yeah, it buzzed off again. Okay, well, let's go now because someone's buzzing the phone again. Buzzing, John. Okay, right. Yeah, right. Have a nice day. Right. Fucking assholes. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Someone, you, you can hear someone's buzzing the phone to try and stop us from talking. Now, someone's getting nervous. Someone is getting nervous. And 
that's not a good sign for anybody who's watching the whole place fall in. The House of Cards is just about ready to topple on itself by itself. The more I put out there, the more the British Empire, the British Empire rules, strikes again. That's where I'm at. I'm with Britain, UK, this king, Ernest Augustus, this theatre instrument, my real estate background, <coughs> and native land titles. That's all. Just native land titles. Who's on the land? How did you get there? Where did you get your authority from? What jurisdiction are you using? And how long do you want to stay for? That's basically what I'm saying. Your occupation title is either terminated or renewed or reassessed to see whether you're credible enough to be on the land. That's all it is. If anybody is violating these acts in here, he will have before, because we haven't used them yet. I haven't used them yet. We're allowed to as the closest partner to the kings who put all that together. The Queen's left the battle scene and went into the EU Parliament. That's her out. That's her out. No matter what she tries to do to get into the Commonwealth with Trump, that's not going to work. I'm telling you right now. The thuggery and piracy is what this flag was given to us for. Anyone who is going to violate or break our laws of kings. You're talking with Queen's laws here. Charlie Hoever and all the incorporations in this country, you're talking Queen's jurisdiction. I'm talking King's jurisdiction. That got you on the land and will get you off the land as a third party. We are second party to Britain, Brexit, British Empire with these kings that I'm using. The three kings, King William III, King William IV and King George IV. And the three chiefs of this country, Te Rewakato Whare Here Re Manukau, Re Whare Re Manukau and Hori Te Kuri. That's it. If you've got anything better than that, with a deed title to go with it, with the names on it and the successors, then you've got no jurisdiction over me and those with deed titles of native origins, with native contracts, private contracts of martial law and magistrate begins, origins, in Edinburgh Magistrate Court and Westminster Magistrate Court. That's it. That's how you got here. Don't argue. Because you'll get a trillion pounds on your head. Just like that. A trillion pounds on your head. Flat out. Trillion pounds. Right there. John Key. That's for you, John Key. If you don't turn up on Friday, next week, the 26th of 25th of January 2018. If you don't turn up, to Te Unga Waka, Marae, Native, Magistrate Court, then the pound notes are on your head with 970 million trillion trillion pounds. Yeah, that one. 970 million trillion trillion pounds on your head, mate, and you're going to lose everything. I'm just telling you now. The King's British Empire strikes back at you and your Queen Thugs, pirates and thugs. You're a thug, pirate, John Key. I'm telling you straight on this video. I know you're in Hawaii having a good time. That'll be your last time having a good time because we'll seize those properties and seize your properties in Australia right over the top with this federal state flag, the King's federal state flag of Admiralty, the King's Admiralty Chief Commander, not Commander in Chief. Chief Commander, here, right here, in here. Okay, you got that in your thick head? You're not going to get away with anything. Panama Papers, Hillary Clinton, Hillary Clinton, and the $13 million you stole out of here, 
and gave to him without the consent of the people, you stole the taxpayers' money. And that's not all you stole. You stole land, resources, natural resources, and money through banks. Fiat money, I'm holding to it against this. Fiat money, US federal state, US dollar, and now Bitcoin. Bitcoin's going to get this shoved up their fucking ass. The shitholes. All you shitholes and Trump is getting this bound out right up your shithole ass. Okay, I can talk like that because everybody's talking like that now to pirates. I'm acting pirate against pirates with all the jurisdictions of pirates to kill a pirate off with this book. The same as your magistrates did when they came here. They had a book too of laws. Whose laws? King's laws. Okay, so that's that. I don't have to ring anybody else. So with that, I think I will charge on and do things. I'm going to just try to think of one or two things to say before I switch the video off. Um, I'm just costed up all the water bottling company for Morris. I've just told them uh, that I will have it at the uh, court hearing in Epsom. I will run that over with them, the figures and the concept that I'm putting together with the tidal turbines and the power generation of hydrogen, jet fuel, rocket fuel. That's in my brain and on plan. Um, so we will pursue that on Morris's land with the honey. Jim, I just asked Jim, how is his honey going? Well, if you play with Americans, that's what he's playing with, American guy that's running his business, it's going to cripple him. And I can see it happening already, just in the tone of his voice and the fact that he's on his own um, with those young people that have given up on him. If he only stuck to me, he would have been right. He had the last failure with Kitty Campbell in Hokianga, in, in Taikari, when she had that uh, hotel over there. And the guy, Camazona guy, that's on my land rocks at home, took it over. Okay, he's the owner, the Camazona guy, the Japanese mountain. Okay, I know the guy and his family at home, Thomas and Morris Camazona. Okay, so that's him there in Kaikari with his own business with another hotel across the other side of the road in Kaikari. So I know quite a bit about land and who's on it. And especially native lands anywhere in the world, even in America. So Daryl, uh, Pam, um, uh, Anna, uh, that name, Ritz, uh, I'm not too fond about her and her um, OPPT and all that. It's going the same way as Karen Hugues. It'll get so far and stop because they haven't got a title. That's, that's how it works. You haven't got the title to the whole country. Not just one bit here, one bit there, one bit there. That's what these marriages are doing. One bit, that's mine, that's the crowns, that's yours, that's yours. No, the whole lot, one shot, came from Britain and the British Empire. Okay, so that's why you have difficulty trying to win in the case in those courts that you have because of all the statute acts. Those are their acts and laws that they can break any day. Same as here. They break it any day. Those are their laws. Not these ones. These ones are not theirs. Those are our laws. Okay, I've got the right to use these things laws to hang them. That's why you can see me hang anybody that gets in the way. And even those 30 that have gone, Maoris, Maoris, that have gone to the World Court, I don't say good luck to them, I'm just saying the first thing they'll ask you in the World Court is, who are you? Who is your chief? And who's in charge of the flag? Who is the right recipient of that flag you're flying? Is it 1835 or 1834 or is it something else? You see, that's where they'll get caught. 
Kali and all those old people are not up to speed with this law, the monarchs. They're not up to speed. And their name doesn't feature in Westminster. And so they'll ask them in the World Court, what's your complaint? Just a, it's a Maori complaint. I said, hmm, Maori? We can't see Maori on our books. Sorry, but you'll have to stay in the New South Wales, Australia jurisdiction because that's what the license is going on in New Zealand, on the New South Wales, and try to settle with you their contract. Where is the British contract? Where is the British license, Mr. Charlie Hohepper? Where is your license and your title? Your name, your background, your whakapapa, your everything, because we've got it there. We've got the names here, and we don't see your name on it. So what are you here for? Oh, we got a complaint. I got a complaint against you. Oh, against the Crown in New Zealand. Who is the Crown? Tell me who is the Crown in New Zealand? And Charlie said, well, it's the Queen. And the World Court says, not according to others. She's left the battle scene. She's not there. She's in the EU Parliament. You've got no Queen. You've got no seal of the Queen in your government in New Zealand. And you can't come here to set up an embassy for Maori in New Zealand because the Maori's got one set up with us as the eight-point star of King William III. You're here with King William IV flag, but these Maori people have got King William III. That's us in the world court because that's who we are. We are King William III. And Mr. John Wan was talking about King William III in his flag. So what's your flag got besides King William IV? What else has it got? Because it goes further back than that. Oh, we're only here for Maori. Well, I'm sorry. Maori belongs to the Crown Government in Wellington. The Beehive. They own that name. And the patents. You don't own it. So you'll have to go back and see them before we're going to handle your case. You have to go back to your new Prime Minister, the lady. The one that's taken out from the other corrupted side that John's calling shitholes. So you'll have to go back to those shitholes to get permission from the Queen that you say you got when she's not there. She's over here with me in Brussels. She's come to try and steal the fortune of King William III and this flag and Maui Memorial. So I'm afraid you'll have to go back and talk to the Governor General, Patsy Reddy, the other crooked bitch. You gotta go and talk to her and this little tot bitch, Jacinda Ardern, just fresh out of nappies in politics with a crooked jurisdiction and legacy that this pound note has our interest in it over their heads. So I'm afraid you're, you're one of the debtors. We'll handle your case but we'll just park it up because you're not the owner. You're not the commercial landowner of New Zealand. Neither are you showing us any fact cited evidence of who you are, where you fit in without borrowing anybody's whakapapa. Where is your own Charlie Joseph's whakapapa? Where's the Joseph bit in this title over these Manukau's and these Wanoa's and these Bakers? The Baker's honest because he's saying he's a Baker. You're saying you're Hohepa. We don't see any Hohepas on our list here in Brussels. Sorry, go home. And that's what they did with Sue Nikora because she's a Nicholas. A Nikora is just another name for Nicholas. So there's no Nicholas on Westminster or the United Nations. There's no, there's no Joseph there either. When you go to the United Nations, you're borrowing somebody else, one of the old people you're taking along with you, and shafting them, Charlie. I'm putting it on you. Don't play around with this. 
or the old people you've dragged in with the original surnames because they don't know any better. They're watching you and following you and you've already screwed some Maoris off already in buying land back and then you've got your coins, your stupid coins now. This is a pound note that started off this country in the first place and it's going right over your little coins and you're going to bankrupt them. One shot, Charlie. Watch. Watch what the king says. Not the queen, the king. You got that in your thick head? And your family supporting you? Matua Karana. It's just another name. You've got a Maori crown, federal state flag, and government running here, dual with us in Britain and the king against your queen. That's run off and abandoned you. Maoris. She got all the money out of you, Maoris. And screwed you, Maoris, at the same time. You're the ones that sold this land in this country. It wasn't yours. It was not your land to sell, Mr. Koheba. You've duped everyone. And all the people who've taken it along with you gets the 970 million sitting from pounds right on your head. I know I'm counting. It's just as well you fellas booted me off Titi Marai because that sets me right out of your jurisdiction into our own. But Morris, it's fortunate that Morris came to rescue me and take me to his home because when I saw his home, it's the Ratna Church that's got all the authority in this world inside it with its flag from Ratna. P.W. Ratna's flag is in there. It's got more mana than Ratna down in Wanganui. That's a second hand, third party. The first party is Lobo inside this little house they abandoned because it didn't look very good. I tell you what, it might not look good, but it has the manner, it has the title, and it has the history of Taheke, Horeke, and Rawere, Mangu, and Firinaki tied up with Kuri Te Kuri. Te Kuri, not Na, no Na. Everything that got nga on it is corrupted. Nga this, nga that, nga here, nga up, nga down, nga under the tum -tum, under the ground. If you come from under the ground, you better crawl back in the hole and go back down there where you came from, right down the other side. If it's a flat earth, earth you'll drop out the bottom. All those flat earth people, you better bugger off because it's bullshit. It's bullshit. You people need your head shot in because as far as I can see, you're making it up. The same crooked fucking bitches in universities that have turned the world upside down, put north up and south down. It's the other way around, south up and north down. The sun shines down that way, not up that way, down that way. When you look up, it's up there. At least from this end, the south, the hottest part, closest to the sun, you fucking stupid bitches and your flat earth. The sun is over here. And the closest distance is on my fucking land blocks at the East Cape, Tepito, to Tepito, birth of this world, in Rapa Nui, to Moko Nui, Moko Nui, to Rapa Nui, big shine and big face down East Coast on my land blocks.